Uh oh. Here comes someone. Hi, Daddy. Hi, Willow. <laughs> I'm doing a video. Yeah. yeah. It's Abby and Willow. Yeah. See this? Watch out for the fishing lures. Touch the hooks. You wanna say hi? Hi. Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. Say, just keep testing. Keep testing. <laughs> say, peace out. Good job. You know, oh, yeah. I thrown up all kinds of signs there. It's out. Good job. Say bye. See you later. Bye. See you later. Okay. What are you guys doing? <laughs> I'm making a video. That's my son, Ezra. Can you shut the door? All right. Thanks, buddy. Love you. <laughs> so that was my three kids. You only saw Willow, but Abby and Ezra were here, too. As I was saying, though... <laughs> oh, you guys. I've been trying to make this video for like 15 minutes and my that young... That's new board. Yeah, that's my board. I'm going to show that in another video. That's a different announcement. Not not a huge one, but it's pretty dope. Pretty exciting. I got a custom musky board built and made for me. Yeah, and she likes it. I've already measured Willow on this board probably three or four times. She thinks it's pretty awesome. So I keep trying to make this video, you guys, and this little stinker just keeps coming in. So I think I'm just gonna have to make this video with Willow on my lap. Okay, you ready? <laughs> okay. Oh, she's already getting down. Oh, this is our wild one. She's our youngest. She is a goofball. Oh, watch out for the hooks. And uh, she's just a spitfire, pure entertainment. This one. Is that that one? Yeah, be careful. Be nice. Mm. You know? One. She's touching a bunch of lures. Custom lures I just received one. from Mike Conklin, Conklin Lures. He's actually part of this video in this announcement. One. I, one. Yep. Mm. Yeah, they can't see him yet though. That's a surprise. Oh, don't pull on that tail too much. Okay. I'm sorry you guys. I just just gonna make a video. That cute fish? She said that's a cute fish. Yeah, that's that's a cute fish. On board. Hey, yeah, it is on the board. Hey, can you go play with Abby and Ezra? Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. love, I love you. Yeah. Bye. Bye. See you in 30 seconds. <laughs> you got it? Pull, pull now. Pull towards you. Here, Daddy will help. No, <laughs> okay. So I was trying to be, you know, all professional and formal with this video, but I give up. This is seriously like the fifth time I try. She keeps coming in. So we're just going to leave it. This is just my life. Okay, you guys? So here is the big announcement. <laughs> here's, here's, it is. This is cool news. I've been, I've been so eager and excited to share this with you guys. And I was just waiting for the 100% approval. I was just waiting for a green light to go public. And obviously I received it. Uh, and I had this grand idea in mind as to how I was going to do this announcement. And I had all this backstory and it was just going to be great. Uh, but obviously my daughter Willow had other plans in mind. So you've seen the thumbnail. You've seen the picture when you clicked on this video. And all I can tell you guys is this. When I started Just Keep Casting, I did not have high expectations. I did not have these big lofty goals. My vision was very basic, very simple. I wanted to meet some people, make some new friends, and, and help them out. And I thought if I meet, you know, like a dozen guys, and we, we kind of start growing this small but really positive fishing community with a great atmosphere. And then we just hopefully little by little, uh, it, it spreads. That was it. I thought that's all I, I envisioned. That's all I'm hoping for, just keep casting. And if you follow my channel from the beginning over the last three and a half years or so, obviously uh, my initial goals and aspirations, just keep casting has, has far exceeded that. You know, The one thing I can touch on the most for the sake of time is my, my idea with the musky battle event. Um, I never thought it would get as big as it has already. I never thought we'd be staying at resorts for free, sponsoring the event. I never thought I, I'd meet and fish with SB Fishing. You know, he's now come to the Muskie Battle more than once. And, and the countless other YouTubers, other channels I've, I've been blessed to rub shoulders with, hang out with, fish with, film with. Uh, you know, honestly, guys like Mark Kornoski, uh, Mike Ducci. If it wasn't for Mike Ducci, uh, Muskie Battle really wouldn't have taken off to the next level. And there's, there's dozens of guys just through Muskie Battle alone that I met via Just Keep Casting. I never would have met otherwise. And outside of Muskie Battle, there are guides, there are lure manufacturers, dozens and dozens of guys that I am now friends with that I did not know. We, we didn't know each other. We never would have met. 
if I hadn't started to just keep casting. So all of these friendships that have blessed me tenfold, all of these opportunities, all these experiences, you guys, I never expected, I never anticipated any of it. Seriously, I had very basic, simple goals and I would have been content with a lot less because the truth is, you guys, I don't own a boat. I'm not a guide. I'm not a tournament angler. I don't make lures. I barely fish to begin with. I do my best with the limited time I have to put out halfway decent entertaining content for you guys. Um, but I only fish a fraction of the time compared to most, you know, weekend warriors, guides. Take your pick. It doesn't matter. I am only fishing a fraction of the time. But I enjoy it. I'm passionate about it. And I make the best of every day that I'm on the water. And I don't take it for granted. I, I truly am so excited every time I know I'm going fishing. And I'm so thankful every time I'm on the water because I don't know when I'll be out again next. It might be two, three weeks. Sometimes it's two months will go by before I go fishing again. So with that said, today's announcement, it's a big deal for me personally because I'm very thankful and grateful. I never expected this. I never anticipated this. And this is not by any means me over celebrating the success of my channel. I have a small channel. I'm not doing this for a living. I never will. That was never my intent. And again, I don't ever expect that to happen. But this opportunity that just came up, uh, the phone call I received, I, I never expected this. And I was completely blown away by this opportunity. So what's the announcement? There's actually two announcements, okay? And I'm going to go backwards in time. And I'm going to start with my first official sponsorship, okay? You guys saw me holding up in the thumbnail pick this particular bait. I just picked up yesterday from my good friend Mike Conklin at Conklin Lures. If you've watched any of my videos, he makes a variety of lures, topwater, bucktails, you name it, but he's most known uh, for these types of baits, the one I just held up. It's called the Glitch. It's a glide bait, and uh, he has a, a traditional standard version with no tail, and then obviously the one I just held up with a tail. I met Mike probably about a year and a half into Just Keep Casting. We started talking online. We went fishing together once. We ended up fishing again with my good friend Aaron Stack, who I met through Muskie Battle. I mean, you guys, the web of connections to Just Keep Casting, it's crazy. I never expected it. It's awesome. I'm so thankful for all these friendships I've been able to make through my channel. But I met Mike Conklin. We started hanging out, fishing together a little bit, talking. He gave me a prototype bait, glide bait. I'm a glide bait guy. I love him. And started using it. Immediately started catching fish on his glide bait that he gave me. And now, you guys, I, I've lost count. I probably have like 10 to 15 of his glide baits. I, I might might be more now. I don't know. I lost count. But for about a year and a half, almost two years, I was using his stuff, but I was I was buying baits off of him. Um, you know, we were just friends, but I wanted his, his lure company to kind of succeed, to take off. He didn't have these big expectations. He, he's not trying to get into the lure game by any means, uh, but he makes a batch of lures here and there. And so I thought, you know what, I'm going to try to help this guy out. These baits are sick. I like the way they look, they work, they catch fish. And most importantly, they're budget friendly, which if you know anything about me, I'm on a budget. Okay. And, and some of these musky lures, you guys, they look cool. They catch fish. They're great baits. They're well-made. You guys, I can't be affording $100, $200 lures. I mean, for me, I'm just being real. It's absolute insanity. I can get four to five baits for a hundred bucks, different sizes, different colors, different diff different presentations, different action. I can catch more fish on five baits than I can on one, okay? I'm just being real. So for me, I'm always about efficiency and being budget-minded, being budget-friendly. So when Mike told me how much he charged for his glide baits, I was like, dude, that's insane. These things are top-notch. They look great. They're high quality. And most importantly, they catch fish. So for about a year and a half, two years, uh, we were just friends, but I would use his lures. He gave me a few prototypes for free. I bought probably about six or seven from him. And to my surprise, last year when we went to uh, northern Minnesota to film with and to fish with Mike Keys from Keys Outdoors and Brian Schaefer, I have another video for that. Uh, just need a moment of silence right now because that trip just absolutely kicked our butts. Yeah. Musky fishing, the reality of musky fishing. That's what that trip was. Uh, but anyways, back to this video. And, and now that we're over my, my mild depression I just experienced. But on our way to Minnesota, my buddy Mike Conklin Lures, he offered me a sponsorship. He said, dude, we've been friends for a couple years now. You're always catching fish on my baits. You're always sharing pictures. You're always putting out content. He said, if you want, I'd love to work with you moving forward. I'd like to sponsor you. I'd like to bring you onto the Conklin Lures team officially. And I was blown away. I was so excited. I was so pumped. Conklin, 
gliders, the Glitch specifically, is hands down my number one glide bait. I have replaced the majority of all my gliders, unfortunately, and I'm a glide bait guy, and I have a lot of them. I still like Phantoms. I still like Mantas. I like uh, Warlocks. I could go on and on. There's a lot of gliders out there that work, and they're great baits, um, but over the last two seasons, my collection of gliders, other gliders, has just gone down, and I've sold or traded them, and they're all getting replaced with glitches, and I just keep getting more. Can't help it. Sorry. And this was happening, guys, well before... I got the sponsorship. Mike just offered me this sponsorship with Conklin Lures back in September of 2020. And trust me, I already had like 12 of his baits <laughs> before that happened. Uh, so Mike Conklin, you're awesome. You make great baits. You have a variety of lures. They all work. They all catch fish. Obviously, I'm partial to the glitch. But just an incredible guy. Well-crafted, well-designed, cool-looking lures, most importantly, that will 100% catch you fish and catch you muskies. Uh, so that's the first part of this announcement is that I am now sponsored by Conklin Lures, and I couldn't be happier. It's my favorite glide bait, hands down, and I'm so pumped to keep using his stuff and to show it to you guys in action, real time, show you guys what his baits are capable of. And, and you guys, they're cheap. You can get these gliders, you guys, stuff like this, 25 to 35 bucks, okay? And I know his special custom orders might cost you a tad bit more, but still, you go do some shopping, you compare $30 to what's out there for other gliders, you're gonna be blown away. Don't pass this up. Go check out Conklin Lures right now and order some of his baits. You won't regret it. But the other part of this announcement, part two, it keeps getting better, is that I received a phone call back around Thanksgiving 2020, so a little before, maybe a little after Thanksgiving, from a guy named John. What's up, John? Super cool guy. Still can't believe you called me. But um, John works for Okuma Fishing Tackle, okay, Okuma Fishing Company. And obviously, Okuma is one of those brands, uh, you know, you see, the, you see the logo, you immediately recognize it. If you've been in the fishing game for 20 years or so, Okuma is on that level of all these other prominent, big, worldwide fishing companies. And I, I couldn't believe when he said he was from Okuma. I honestly, to be truthful, I didn't even really believe it at first. I kind of thought it was a scam. I thought, what the heck, dude? Okuma's not going to be calling me. You know, I'm nobody. My channel's small. I'm not a guy. I don't have a boat. I started thinking of all these reasons as to why this didn't make any sense at all. I never expected it. I never anticipated it. It was never part of my initial goals or vision. It just wasn't even on the radar. So the first 30 seconds or so on the phone call, you guys, I really was trying to figure out, is this a scam or is this for real? Obviously, it turned out to be the real deal. And I was super pumped, so thankful, couldn't believe I was getting this opportunity. And basically, they came across one of my musky battle videos, ironically. And they saw my content. They liked the musky battle video. They liked what they were seeing. They enjoyed it. And they basically said, hey, do you want to be a part of our, our Okuma influencer team, our social media influencer team? And I needed to think about it a little bit because it was a commitment. But I didn't need to think about it too long. As you can imagine, I was so excited. I had to jump at the opportunity. So I talked with my wife. I prayed about it. And obviously, here we are. I showed you guys in the thumbnail. The picture is of this reel, this box. This is, believe it or not, this is the first ice fishing reel I have ever owned in my life. And here comes Willow right on cue. I knew this was going to happen. She can't get the door open. Here I am with the big announcement. And here she comes for her cameo. You're back. Oh, yeah, he's talking again. Oh, you got your, you got your nice panda slippers, I see. Watch out for the hooks. So I'm just going to try to finish this, you guys. So... I've never gone ice fishing. Yeah, go ahead. Make fun of me. Talk trash in the comments. It's okay. I can take it. Uh, hopefully, you'll be seeing my first ice fishing content here in the this near future. This is my coat. Yeah, that is your coat. It's a sweater, really. But um, yes, you guys, so pumped. I'm with Okuma. Cannot thank them enough. Okuma is a huge company. A lot of... I don't even know where to begin. I'm, I'm honestly speechless. The people that they have on their pro staff, their team... Uh, the guys that they have that have their own TV shows, other YouTubers, you name it. I am 100% a small, tiny fish. I am a minnow in a huge, giant lake. You know, I'm like a minnow in Lake St. Clair right now. That's how I feel. Um, can't believe I'm going to be rubbing shoulders with some of these guys, talking with some of them. It's an incredible opportunity, fishing-wise, uh, but just to even learn from their that's, experience. That's that one. Yeah, she like she keeps touching the same one. That's actually, you know. But but just the experience to to uh, glean from these guys uh, that I'm now going to be working with and talking to here and there periodically through through uh, phone calls and conference calls and Zoom calls and whatnot. 
Um, I, I just, it, it's, it's surreal. It really is surreal. And I'm just so grateful. And the truth is, you guys, I, what I wanted to say was this video is so Dad, botched. Did and uh, Dad, Dad, at least I hope it's cute. I hope, oh gosh, now, now I'm getting a phone call. My Dad, daughter. That's cute again. This is just. That's cute again. Can't wait to edit this one. Yeah, it's cute. It's Dad, that's cute. cute too. Yeah, that's cute too. Dad, that's cute. Hopefully this video is at least Dad, cute. Dad, that's cute. <laughs> For you guys. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Okay, can Daddy finish? I gotta, can I finish this? Can you go play? Uh. Okay, yes, sit on my lap then. Um, <laughs> what I was trying to say, you guys, this is so terrible. I hope Okuma doesn't watch this. They're gonna be like, oh my gosh, this dude's first video talking about us is absolutely <laughs> terrible. Okay, go play. <laughs> oh my gosh, I give up. But, this is so important. I, I wanted to say, you guys, everything that has happened from day one with Just Keep Casting, it would not have happened without you guys subscribing and watching my content. You know, Musky Battle, all my other videos, all these friendships, all these connections, you know, my buddies that are guides that take me out sometimes, my buddies that are, you know, lure manufacturers that I've been fortunate to test out some of their stuff, use some of their stuff. There's multiple guys beyond Conklin Lures. But the truth is, you guys, none of this would happen. None, none of this would have happened. None of this would be possible it, across the board. Everything that Just Keep Casting has become would not have happened without you guys supporting me, following me, subscribing, and watching my videos. So the first thing I want to say is I want to thank you guys. I just want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. This has been an incredible ride. I have been so blessed from this experience, and it just keeps getting better. And without question, there's no doubt in my mind, without people like you, a lot of you are still strangers we've never even met in person. I, I always try to interact on social media. I do the best I can. I enjoy talking to all of you guys. I always try to respond to all the comments. Um, but most of you, the reality is we've never even met. We've never even had a conversation in person. We've never gone fishing together. Maybe that'll change in the future. But I don't even know most of you. And even though Just Keep Casting has a small following, it's not a huge channel. You know, we're coming up on 2,000 people right now. That's still 2,000 people. I mean, yeah, you can compare it to bigger channels. And, and I'm nobody. And I'll, I'll readily admit that. But I don't take for granted 2,000 people almost uh, that have got my back and that have supported my channel and, and, and have helped it grow to the extent that now... Okuma, which is a huge company, a well-known brand, now Okuma is bringing me on board to, to work with them and to, to, to do my best to represent the Okuma fishing name. So it's a big deal to me. I don't take it for granted. I don't take it lightly. And I, I appreciate you guys. I, I am so thankful that Okuma has given me this opportunity. I'm going to make the best of it. I'm going to work hard. I hope I do well for them. And yeah, I mean, that, that's it, you guys. This video is not anything I intended it to be. I did not imagine it going this route, but I love my kids. I love my daughter. I don't really care at the end of the day. All you need to know is uh, Just Keep Casting is now with Okuma, and you'll be seeing me in the near future very soon using a lot of their awesome gear. I can't wait to test it out, use it, start catching the fish on Okuma Tackle. And obviously, you're gonna see me chucking a lot of Conklin lures regardless. Uh, he could drop me tomorrow, I'd still be using them. <laughs> I don't even care because they catch fish. So I'm excited, I'm looking forward to 2021. It's gonna be a good year, I'm pumped, stay tuned. Hopefully I'll bring you guys some content in the next couple weeks. Hopefully my first ice fishing video, so wish me luck with that. I'm gonna finally brave the cold and brave the ice and get after it. Um, that's it you guys, like always, just keep casting.